how's it going? So, as most of you know, my new EP called Wonderment is getting ready to release in less than two weeks, and as that's getting ready to come out, I've been thinking a lot about my first EP, and I've gotten a little bit nostalgic, but I've also gotten a lot of requests from you guys asking me to film a little tutorial and asking for the chords and tab, like, uh, tab sheets for how to play She, which is the song off of that EP. It's a song I wrote mainly about my sister. I wrote it just kind of to be encouraging because she's done a lot for me and been there for me. Kind of a cheesy moment. But I wrote it for her just to kind of encourage her a little bit. And so here we are, finally. I sat down, I've got my guitar. We're gonna film that tutorial today. And I'm also gonna put probably a little instrumental version at the end of this video. That way anyone that wants to um, sing along or film a cover or whatever it'll be there so hopefully this is helpful I've never filmed a tutorial before so I'm sorry if I'm bad at this or if it's all over the board or it doesn't make any sense but I'm gonna try really hard I typically play it with the capo on the fourth fret but sometimes I'll play it on the fifth fret just depending on what kind of mood I'm in and so today we're playing it on the fourth fret and the basic chords to this song are G, E minor, C, and D every once in a while. And the intro basically just goes like this. I'm going to take my thumb, sorry my necklace keeps hitting my guitar. I'm going to take my thumb and just pluck the top string twice. And then use my first finger and just strum the rest of the strings. So it's G, and then E minor, same thing. Back to G, E minor, and then it goes right into the first verse, and that just repeats for the whole first verse of the song. So once you get through the first verse, you're gonna end on E minor. And it's going to jump straight into the chorus, which is just C, G, back to C, G, D, and then C, and then G, or er, sorry, D, <laughs> then E minor. And it just ends on E minor, of course it does. So I guess I'll just go ahead and play through that with the vocals. So this will be what you have so far. So you got the intro. And the first verse and stuff. And then the chorus is just, she's got a heart of gold, she's brave and she's bold. back to G after that. You're basically playing the intro. Yeah, after the chorus, it's just... to the second verse, which is the same as the first verse, it's just G and E minor, and you're just going back and forth between those, like you did in the intro, just repeating that, and then you go right back into the chorus. So you're basically just repeating those things twice. Hopefully that made sense. After the second chorus, it goes to the bridge, which is just C, and then D, and then G. Now, here we're going to 
gonna do something a little, little tricky. Not really, but you're gonna go from G, then you're gonna slide your second finger down one fret, and then go straight to E minor. So it's gonna sound like this. All you're doing is just sliding that second finger down one fret and playing your keeping the other fingers in the same position. So it goes from that to the second part of the chorus. So you're gonna play the bridge and then it goes to perfectly imperfect, which is C. And then G. It's the same thing where you're just sliding your second finger from the third fret to the second fret and then to E minor. So after you've finished that last chorus after the bridge, that's it. The song's over pretty much. I mean, you just play the outro is the same as the intro, so it's just G and then E minor and then G, E minor. So. I'll go ahead and record a little instrumental version for anyone that wants to sing along <laughs> or record their own cover. And the lyrics will be in the description. So that's it. Thank you for watching and for listening. And uh, I hope that you guys will check out my second EP when that comes out. We're aiming to release it on September 11th, but there might be a single that is available before then as kind of a pre-order. But anyways, I hope that that was helpful and I'll see you guys in another video next Saturday. Bye!